social media gets a whole lot less scary when you've got content pillars to fall back on. So what a content pillar is, is 12 things or 12 topics that have to do with your business or the service that you offer or the expertise that you have. So one for every single month of the year. So we like to do 12. And then if you wanna get even less frustrated by social media, you're then going to decide how many posts do you want per day. So let's just say you're shooting for one post per day, Monday through Friday. That's gonna be five posts every single week. And how many weeks are there in a year? There's four. So on every single content pillar, I use ChatGPT. It's what we use for our clients all the time. You come up with your 12 content pillars and then you brainstorm of each of these content pillars, what four questions do I want to answer? You're gonna answer one question or one subtopic every single week, and then you're gonna ask ChatGPT or your team and brainstorm, and of these four subtopics, what are five different ways to talk about this subtopic or answer this subtopic's question? And so now you have one content pillar for every single month of the year one subtopic for every single week of that month, and one topic point for every day of the week. And now extrapolate this as many times as you want based on the number of content posts that you want to go out per day or per, per week. But that is a really great way to schedule out or get a better idea of 365 days of content without having to stress. And then we recommend using some sort of scheduling software so what we do for all of our companies is uh, we will schedule, we want one post per day or we want two posts per day. We're gonna go ahead and brainstorm those and then we're gonna go ahead and schedule those posts that we want or we are going to require of ourselves to post on that regular basis. That way we don't even have to think about it, we don't even have to worry about it, it's just automatically going to happen for us. Then we like to put another piece of content in. So we encourage ourselves or our clients to take a photo or a video from that day because then what you're doing is you're actually giving people behind the scenes but because you're not having to stress about posting every single day if you miss a day it's no big deal because you're still posting it allows you to show up more organically for your followers which means you're going to increase engagement you're going to increase reach you're going to increase all of the things that you're actually looking for so we recommend content pillars. That's the best way to do it. We've got a podcast where my husband and I talk about our business tips, tricks, life, marriage, all of that kind of stuff. And in an upcoming episode, we're gonna go over how we use ChatGPT and we're even gonna give away a free download with our actual prompts from our actual chats and teach you how to build out a chat because prompts don't really matter if you don't have the chat set up the correct way. So check out Velvet Ventures for that, velvetventurespodcast.com. Um, but other than that, we highly recommend content pillars.